All right, one popular question, something that agents need to know and they ask a lot about is your warm market. There's agents that believe that, okay, working on warm market is good, but some believe that it'll last forever, right? And there's others believe that literally after you contact your immediate family that it's over, right? I, here, here's my belief. I get asked this question a lot because there's a lot of beliefs around the country when it comes to working your warm market. I'm a big believer in working your warm market. I worked my warm market early on in the insurance business and it helped me make tens of thousands of dollars as a new agent and learn this business and learn how to talk, learn how to present, learn how to talk to people, learn how to fact find, learn how to warm up, right? It's easier with your warm market. I'll also make sure that I mention how to approach your warm market, but I've got something that works that's a quick idea that I call the rolling 100. How about my Apple Watch background there too though? A little secure agent mentor, how about that? The rolling 100. With the rolling 100, what that means is, and you guys probably already understand what I'm gonna say, write down 100 names and numbers. 100 names and numbers of people that you know or that know you, right? That's pretty broad. That could be immediate family. That could be long lost family. That could be cousins. That could be, you know, that could be your pastor. That could be people from your church, people you work out with, people you work with, people you used to work with, people you don't even like, people you like a lot. People you hate, like it, people you play sports with, people you went to high school with, college with, like th there's endless uh, people in your networking group. There's endless amounts of people in our warm market. If I had to sit down right now, and I I worked my warm market, right? If I had to get down, sit down and write about, if I had to come up with a brand new business and I had to write down a thousand names this weekend of people that could go into my rolling. 1,000, and in that example, I could, and so could you. So but we're gonna start with 100. So you start, you start with the best 100 that you think there is. And so what you do is, you write them down, then you contact them, right? And there's always a goal, so what's the goal? The goal is to schedule an appointment. It's to set an appointment. It's to get in front of them, right? It's literally just to get in front of them, right? Get in front of them, okay? Then from there, if you, if they say no, or if they buy, you take them off the list. So you have a hundred names. Let's just say you got John, Betty, Sue, these are some good names. Corb, right? You got different names. And let's just say that John says no. I take him off. Let's say Betty buys, right? This one says no. Now, you know what? Be Betty's are normally not easier to sell, right, than, than Sue's. So, you know what? Betty did not, you, you, Betty, no answer. Can't get a hold of her. Sue, she's a buyer. Every Sue I've ever met, they, were, they bought insurance. They'll probably do the same with you. Find Sue's in your life. They buy, all right? So you take those off. Corb, he just, you know, keeps putting you off, right? Just the kind of duty is keeps putting you off. Okay, so out of these four, what you do is you take John and Sue off, and you have 96 other names on this list too, right? And numbers. You take John and Sue off, but then you put two new names on the list to replace John and Sue, and that's what I call a rolling 100. So that whether you're been in the business one day, eight months or 38 years, you've always got a rolling 100. And, and I hate to ignore my warm market, right? Because there's big reasons you don't want to ignore your warm market. They care about you, you care about them. If something happened to them, you will feel like absolute crap. True or false, right now. True or false, you definitely will. And they're easier to get in front of than a cold call or a lead. True or false. Also extremely true. So, I believe in approaching your warm market. When I approach them, you say, well, what do you say, Cody? Let's just say that the, the one that bought, Sue. Sue, hey, it's Cody, how are you? How's the kids, how's the family? Hope all's been well. Hey, I'm in the insurance business now. 
I love it. Like it's gonna be my career for life. It's amazing. If you're not confident, they won't be confident about you. Be confident. I know that you own insurance. I'm gonna buy you pizza. I'm gonna come over. I just wanna review your policies and see if I can save you any money. I'm sure you let me do that. What night works best for you guys typically? Like a Tuesday or a Thursday? Did I ask if they wanted to talk about insurance? Did I ask if I could come over? Did I ask if they had insurance? Did I ask if they were interested in more insurance? None of that matters. The goal is always to get in front of them. So that's my rolling 100. You've got, I promise you, everybody watching this video right now has a minimum, minimum, pay attention to me, minimum of 100K right now waiting to be deposited into your bank account by helping your warm market. And you can do that with a rolling 100 that you're always taking off and adding more to. So when you go make 100K this year in 2019 from this rolling 100 idea that Cody Askins gave you, make sure you come back to this video and you put comments below giving me and Dylan Corbett some credit. Thanks for watching, appreciate you guys. Make sure you subscribe. If you have questions, anytime, comment below. Appreciate it.